Hello and welcome to my homestead. This is my favorite time for flowers, so I want to show you some more tulips today. The Red Emperor, all the way in the far end, has almost finished blooming. In the meantime, we have these gorgeous yellow ones taking over, as well as some of these fantastic orange. Absolutely gorgeous flowers. They have just started opening up. This is Apple Dorm and Elite. Now take a look at these. Very unique, very unique structure. It has a little bit of a green and orange on the outside and the inside. This is the Yellow Emperor. And a little bit of black on the inside. Be careful, it has a red rim. So this is what I was hoping to have. And of course there is trees that are blooming next to them. As I said, this is my favorite time of the year. There is a single one that's out of place. I've shown you these red emperors before. They're absolutely stunning. Look at the size of these. They're huge. Huge flowers. All right, so let's go along to the back side of the garden, to my backyard, and I'll show you some more tulips there. So before we go in, here are some more narcissus, daffodils, also gorgeous. Here are the red cherry, red jumbo cherries, and jumbo indeed. And they've been also, unfortunately, decimated by the voles and moles. You can see, this is what I have to deal with every single day. Just like that, there is nothing left. The critters eat everything. Uh, all of this has been planted, they eat it all. One by one, they just destroy everything. All of these have been destroyed. What I want to show you are some colors here. These are unique. This is not what I had ordered. The sound you're listening is supposed to repel all of the walls and moles and it does not do anything. So if you're looking for a protection system, don't bother buying them. They're useless. But look at these colors. They're gorgeous or what? So the rest are just beginning to get open and there are also different colors. You can see a little bit of yellow with red. It will open up and some more yellows. So let's transition to the other side of the gar of the backyard and I'll show you some of the um, other varieties. So here are a couple more boxes. The Akebono and the Helmar. So this is the Helmar, the very first one. And this is Akebono, much smaller, more yellow. These used to be white. You can see the remaining of the petals. They're already finished blooming. But let's go take a look on the outside to Banya Luca. So here we are. Same, 
Same problem as on the other side of the garden, as you can see. They're also just destroying all the flowers, so I have no choice but to take this flower now off and put it in water and hope that it will still bloom. But look at the color of these. These just opened up today. Absolutely gorgeous. This is called Banya Luca. So all of these tulips are all the same variety. You can see what they look like before they open up. And here is how they are opening. But this is what the walls do. And you can see the entry hole. They create these holes and they just live there and they eat everything from the underneath. So all of this is destroyed. All of these tulips were, were eaten. But at least I can enjoy what I still have. So I'm focusing on the positive. And on that pretty note, one last look on the inside of Banya Luka. And thank you for joining me and until next time.